were your European roots discussed? Did your parents talk about? They what? Were the a European? Parents, yeah. Did your parents talk about the family history? Well, I think that my family. It was always very radical politically to the left and sophisticated in terms of dealing with the negation of the diaspora and so on. There were no um, clear acts of aggression in, in discourse against diasporism in general, or the diaspora, or Jewish roots, or whatever, Yiddish, or whatever you call it. It was not, I see it in other families where it's much more, it's omnipresent. In my family, it was all directed to one particular individual in my family, my grandmother, where she was called the Polish, first of all. She was referred to as Polish, generally, and each kind of caring a bit too much or being overtly, overtly um, cautious about something has been dubbed as a Polish way of... of uh, of living, so she she was she was some kind in our family some kind of um, I I now I criticize it but as a kid I participated I did not understand the full meaning of it the whole hatred to to diaspora the whole um, the whole negation of it was concentrated in this one individual who was both funny grotesque weak. All the, the qualities that are associated uh, in, in, in the anti-diasporist and uh, anti-diaspora uh, sensibility. Yeah, so no, we didn't speak about specific things. We didn't speak about Chedlets. I later learned that her father wrote a Yisko book about it and I read it in Yiddish. But I never knew that he even wrote it. I mean, I never knew that there was any... I, I, I heard about Chilets only much later. I think that, yeah, in the other side, the one that comes from Uvruj, yeah, I knew that there was a pogrom. I knew that there was... But, but no life, right? The only glimpses of information about Europe or European life were the, those that are connected with why it's bad to be there. Right, with anti-Semitism, with uh, no, no, no life.